at the moment anyway and just the levels that they're pushing each other hey and a massive difference i noticed so when we're groms during the masters you go out box and there was always like the local guys you knew like taj or jay or whatever would get waves but the current crop out there like the bodyboarders shano max and all them they were just waiting and getting whatever set they wanted like back in the day maybe hardy would do that but no one else all the modern crew it didn't matter whether it was you were riding a surfboard or a bodyboard dudes that sat there and waited were getting waved like mm. shano was getting bombs viv Bram vivian max mcgregor who's old school chad mcgregor's son that was cool seeing him out there he got this one pit you've probably seen on socials and it spat so hard. He just come off at the end and his bodyboard flew out of the pit. Oh, is that him? Yeah. Went straight past me. I had my camera a bit tight. So I tried to follow the bodyboard, but I totally missed it. <laughs> <laughs> but that was, yeah. There's a couple of, yeah, sick waves from out of the days. And, oh, Sierra Kerr. Yeah. Her and her dad come out. He, Josh rides it as good as anyone. Hey, he was on a really small board, tucking under, pretty late drops and just, knows that wave really well he was pretty impressive out there did right? you do any punts at all at the end no, no. Uh, a little one off the back a couple of turns but his um daughter was giving it a good nudge eh? she had like a full baptism of fire <laughs> yeah well that day one the first day i got down when we we're at rabbits and stuff she got like that feature and stab straight away online yeah that, right? that green wetty pulling in yeah that's a cool shot but yeah. then she the, the next day was bigger right? oh the day you were there day three was i don't know if it was bigger oh it was just it was, it was just different yeah and uh, yeah, this one, you know, you get them big south ones that come up and a few of the photogs, or maybe it was this younger kid, Ned, were yelling at her like, go, go. And then I heard, I think Chris Bryan saying, no, no, the same thing that happened to you that time. Yeah. And so she's paddled for the south one and the last minute pulled off and just gone over the falls, like not pitched, but like, you know, like choked where you slowly get sucked. Yeah. And she got sucked over and then bomb of the day behind it on the head. Wow. She just took it in a, <laughs> took it in a steed, eh? And she didn't hit the bottom or she didn't? No, nah, because when she was pounding past, I was like, did you hit the bottom? She's like, no, no. She didn't really care, eh? That's so good. And she got another one. Her dad was in, um, got the first one, sick one, and he was watching. And then she got another one and uh, started getting a little bit chandelier with the Norvoli, but um, pulled in deep and yeah, she was getting smashed, but popping up, loving it. <laughs> How good's that? <laughs> Must be so good for her dad seeing her daughter, his daughter push the limit as well, like. Not many girls go out there, let's be honest. Yeah. Like she's like, 16. Yeah, that Katie anything. Simmers was out the other day, but yeah, not many others. Yeah. That's so cool. It's um That was such a fun trip in general, apart from all the leashes getting broken. And yeah, you <laughs> broke every flipper and leash <laughs> you come across, hey? I owe you a leash and fin. <laughs> nah, mate. don't worry about it. <laughs> and um, <laughs> that boog, that old school turbo was fun to ride. Yeah. It's hard to wrangle. Man, that thing was slippery as hell, eh? Yeah, you, I can't believe you were actually doing flips on it. And well, I didn't. I didn't land anything. <laughs> <laughs> well, you landed one that was like on dry rocks, like basically yeah. on that inside bit of uh, new novelty wave. Yeah, hell trip, eh? <laughs>